Well, I'm welding. I got my ram welded back on, like that big washer. I got Mrs. CW yelling at me. I'm yelling at her. She's got my neighbor's snowblower. He says, what do you mean? You're going to plow the whole lot with my snowblower? I got these guys here shoveling out. It's a friggin' mess. Two feet of snow. and I'm going to cut this piece of steel off a little long right now, but hopefully nothing else will break right now. My scraper edge, my spring, everything's just... Um, All right, I gotta get back to work. I got welding to do. Watch your eyes. All right, we'll get her done. We'll. Pick her. Steel. I got lots of extra steel around here. Lots of good steel. Expensive steel. T-Ruck. Alright. I think we're done. Put it back on the T-Ruck and go plow. Let it down a little bit. Yep, dingo. Alright, you got the job. You're my professional hour mount, minute mount, hour mount installer. All right, hook up the hoses and uh, go back and plow with my rebuilt ram attachment. Well, I'll fix her up. Thanks, bud. Just when you think your night is over, I got this all welded up. Welded. Broken. Mr. CW gave up. My neighbor so graciously lent me his snowblower, his craftsman that I put the belts on a month ago. So I figured I'd use it if he lent it to me. Mrs. CW was using it, but she gave up. Works pretty well for a craftsman. Bring her up! That's a different story. Anyways, more work. I've been at it since 7 o'clock. It's almost 10 o'clock now. Nothing like having a long day on the job. Oh, i got to get that thing up the hill now. Yep, it's a hill. It's a hill hill. Thanks for looking. <sighs> what a beautiful evening. It's uh, 10 o'clock and I have some news. Remember the Chinese guy delivering the Chinese food in the Saab? I was over here just snow blowing around the fire hydrant because I'm a conscientious landlord, I guess, concerned citizen. And I figured he lost his job after that delivery because I just found the Chinese food in the snow. Soy sauce, anybody? Yep. He just tossed it in the snow along with the rest of his trash. All right, we got this all cleaned out. We we'll finished the sidewalk, and I think we'll call it a night. Bring her up!
Got Chinese food. I think that I'm done, huh? 10 o'clock. I just snow blowed the whole neighborhood. And I get back to my truck and left the engine running so I could warm up. And the power steering is going. I had the engine running in the driveway here so I could get into a nice warm vehicle. But I have some good news. I snow blowed my neighbor's driveway, got stuck in his driveway. And he comes out at 10 o'clock at night after I finish snow blowing his sidewalk. And he says, Corvair Wild, I'm going to give you my snow blower. Yep. So I just got a 28 inch or a 30 inch snow blower that is, I've only got a few hours on it. I fixed it several years ago. All I remember is it's red and we bought it at Old Bouchon Hardware. All I know about it, it's in the shed, it's buried, and now I got power steering oil. So it won't be anymore. Oh boy. There. Noise is gone. All right. Try to say goodnight again. Good night, and thanks for watching my videos. And what a day it's been. Good night, good night, good night. All right. So it's not good night, good night. I was just doing one last pass. The city came by. We plowed in my driveway a little bit, so I'm stuck again. And I'm having a costume failure here. Oh, how annoying. Anyways, I got a shovel. I got my health. And, uh... I'll get it out. It's happened so many times today, I know the routine. I'm just going to plow a little bit behind the, uh, shovel rather, behind the plow. Well, I'll fix her up. There's my scraper edge and my back drag, back drag blade buried. Deal with it in the summer. Oh, it's heavy snow. Oh, yeah. Chunky. Chunky monkey. Alrighty. Good nighty. Good night.